All right, guys, let's talk about how to play Shut Up and Kiss Me. Uh, this is a really catchy song, one of my favorites on the record, and let's talk about how to play it. Today's video is brought to you by Audible.com. With over 180 titles to choose from, you'll never run out of material to listen to. Just use the custom link down in the description box to get your free audiobook today, as well as a 30-day trial. I just finished reading The Night Circus, which is an awesome book, so um, if you're looking for new stuff to listen to, definitely check out audible.com slash The Piano Speaks. This is in D major. And if you kind of, if you think about it, this song has a similar progression to uh, Thinking Out Loud by Ed Sheeran. The uh, progression in Thinking Out Loud is... Right? But, in, and in this song, it's uh... So see, the, we have a pretty similar chorus here. So what we're gonna do is in the very beginning, the intro, you're gonna, so this is in 4-4 time, you're gonna be counting in your head. So D major, and then first inversion, twice, to a G major chord, A major, twice, to a B minor chord, first inversion again, to G major, A major, then it repeats. So after the intro, when you get into the verse, um, it's relatively simple um, progression. With the melody, I'll play slowly. Did you catch that? Probably not, but just keep watching it again if you if you need to repeat it. I know it was a little bit quick, so uh, I can slow it down a, a little bit more. Uh, so D major, first inversion, G major, A major, B minor, first inversion, D major. The melody changes a bit. So it's D major, first inversion again, and then the right hand I'm just alternating between B and D's. So. So that's um, D, D, B, A, D, D, B, A. So maintain that progression. So again. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> so now the chorus is quite similar to the intro um, in terms of style and the chords. It just has a melody. So it's B A B D E. Shut up, shut up, shut up. And the, those voices are singing on a D at the top, so you can include that with your D chords. That, that melody is F sharp, E, D, E, D. And this is an A chord in the left hand. And now D major chord. A major chord. 
So again, I'll play it again and we'll do the melody this time. So what's interesting about this chorus is that it takes elements of uh, the intro, puts it into the chorus, and then also it, it, it adds in a different melody at the very beginning of it. So you kind of like a, have a blend of, of style there. I'll play the chorus one more time. After the second verse, right. So now you're gonna just kind of uh, jazz on a D chord here for eight beats. do whatever you want at this point um, but as long as you get back to the to the final chorus um, that that's the goal so he does a melody that's like shut 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 right so you can do that if you want um, and you can do D A D D A A A D A A to be able to reach an octave to do this so it's catchy song um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed it and let me know if you have questions thanks guys see you next time